Selling my soul to I'm not bitter. Selling my soul to the high. We are the Jacob Jeffries bitter. band. We've been playing music together for seven years. We all moved up from Florida, really. Mine is Ben. Ben's from New Orleans. I think for a while it was me writing songs and then bringing them into a room like this and everybody kind of delivering what they could. But recently we have a, a space in Brooklyn that we've been working out of and uh, we'll just kind of organically come up with uh, something fresh together, which is fun. I'm uh, Alex Mead Fox. I'm Tom Tierney. This is Spaceman Sound. We grew up in the suburbs outside of Boston, and we used to play in sort of like punk and ska bands together. We just started talking about like, hey, maybe one day we should have a recording studio. Which, of course, you know, it snowballs into like, yeah, there'll be a sandwich shop in the back, and we'll sell records, and people can sleep there, and there'll be a venue. But uh, the sort of typical like liberal arts nonsense of like, we're going to do everything and we're going to do it all ourselves. We have a huge <laughs> warehouse. It's just going to work out somehow. Yeah. So we sort of tried to do that for a couple years at first. And we were li living and working in various loft spaces in, in Bushwick. We're in a, a more of a legitimate space now, but it's still sort of thrown together in a, a DIY manner. We find that the success that is to be made in the music industry at this level is found in reaching different cities personally and like shaking hands with the people of the city. It's that idea of just kind of snowballing it until you can play bigger and better stages. It's a process that works. You just got to keep going at it. Today was cool because it was a uh, live recording. So we had them all set up. Amps were in the room. Vocals are in the room with the drums. We wanted to keep it natural and live and real. And that's something we do a lot. You know, I mean, we intentionally kept the space very live. So it's kind of fun in sessions like today where you can use the vocal mic a little bit as a drum room mic as well. And like, if you're smart about it, get it in a, in a cool place where it still sounds vibey and it can have kind of a more gluey vintage vibe. And we have all, all of these sort of room mics that are placed around that room that, you know, we have two mics mounted in the far corners, uh, large diaphragm condenser mics that are just always there. And we always record with them. Today was like one of the most comfortable experiences I've ever had playing music. There's like a live aspect to it because we're all four in a room just jamming, recording live. For me, like that's top notch, beats it all out. Fly. 